This reading is for you if you're here. Let's dive in and see what's coming through, okay? First, we have the wild card. This card shouts, you are the full package. Say it out loud, I am the full package. Let that message sink in. Feel it. Breathe it. You truly are the full package. You're kind, caring, balanced, and generous. The Six of Pentacles shows balance in your life. There's someone who sees this in you, who recognizes your worth and admires you deeply. But remember, being the full package isn't just about how others see you. It's about how you feel about yourself too. Others may tell you you're beautiful, smart, or kind, but the real power is feeling that way on your own. It's believing in your own worth and embracing it fully. You already hold this strength inside you. You're valuable, exactly as you are, with or without anyone else's validation. So let this be your reminder, you are worthy, beautiful, and complete, just as you are. Someone special has their eyes on you, and they feel a strong pull toward you. They see a true partnership between you two, one where you could face life together as a team. The Three of Pentacles shines here, symbolizing teamwork and balance. This card is all about supporting each other, sharing the ups and downs, and building a lasting connection that stands through thick and thin. This person feels both admiration and care for you. They don't just see a romantic partner, they see someone they want by their side through everything. They truly value your presence and feel you're the one they could share life with, someone they can rely on and enjoy life's adventures with. What's even more beautiful is that they're not coming from a place of control or possessiveness. They respect you and will be honest about their feelings. When they come to you, they'll say, I like you, I care about you, and I think we'd be great together. But here's the key, they'll respect whatever choice you make. They're drawn to you, but they're also ready to honor your decision, knowing that true connection involves both respect and freedom. This person values who you are, both as a teammate and a partner, and they're excited to explore that potential with you, if you're open to it. This person isn't here to force you into anything. They won't come into your life declaring, you're my person, and you have to be with me, leaving you no choice. It's not about control with them. There's someone who will fully respect your right to make your own choice about whether you want to be with them or not. They understand the importance of your freedom and the value of a mutual connection. Unlike the toxic personalities you might see in a Netflix documentary, where someone can't accept no for an answer, this person has a healthy respect for boundaries. They don't believe in pushing or forcing anyone to be with them. Some people think they're entitled to whatever they want, no matter how the other person feels, but that's not this person. They genuinely want you, but they also want you to be happy whether that's with them or not. They're mature enough to handle your decision, even if it's not what they hoped for. This isn't the type of person who will try to control or manipulate you to stay. Instead, they'll be open and honest about their feelings and accept whatever choice you make. They want a real connection, built on respect, not force. And that makes all the difference. The thing here is that they will absolutely respect whether you want to be with them or not. They will respect you, they will want your happiness, which means that if you choose with your free will that, you know what, I'm not really sure, they will be like, okay, that's fine, that's okay. I thought I'd just try. That's the thing here, is that they will be very, very respectful towards you, and that's the most important thing is that respect towards you. The Nine of Wands shows that you're on this person's mind constantly. They imagine how well you'd fit in with their friends, picturing easy laughter and great conversations. 
The Three of Cups highlights this social side. They feel you bring good energy to any group, and they love thinking about sharing that with you. They feel deeply connected to you, drawn to your energy that they find incredibly warm, loving, and genuine. With the Sun card, they see you as a bright light, radiant, positive, and always trying to bring out the best in yourself and others. To them, you're someone who shines from within. They love how you give your all and uplift others without even trying. There's a clear spark between you two, something that feels both warm and comforting, but also exciting. It's a rare kind of chemistry. Then, with the Two of Cups, it's clear that this isn't just admiration, it's a deep, heartfelt connection. They feel a blend of love, respect, and understanding for you that's genuine. It's not just attraction, they see qualities in you they truly admire. You're caring, kind, generous, and always aiming to be the best version of yourself. They respect that. It's these qualities that draw them closer, and they feel lucky to know someone who's so giving and authentic. To them, you're the real deal, someone they'd love to build something meaningful with. The Emperor card here shows that this person is ready to step up and take action. They won't leave you guessing. They'll clearly tell you, this is how I feel about you, this is what I want us to do. They'll lay it all out, inviting you to join in, but giving you full control to respond openly with, yes, this is what I feel, or, no, this isn't right for me. They're here for an honest, two-way connection. The Magician card brings the energy of clear, open communication. This isn't someone who shies away from conversations or avoids difficult topics. They'll make sure both of you are on the same page, wanting to build something real and respectful. With the influence of Mercury here, it's clear that communication is key for them. If they sense you're uncertain or uneasy, they won't hesitate, they'll pick up the phone, check in with you, and talk things through. They'll be straightforward, fair, and ready to listen. They know what they want with you, and they're not afraid to show it. To them, a strong connection means real understanding, shared choices, and constant support. The Seven of Pentacles paired with the King of Swords reveals that this person values you deeply in every decision they make. They're honest, loyal, and straightforward, bringing real integrity to the relationship. When they communicate, they don't just say what you want to hear. Instead, they approach things with a balance of positivity and honesty, ensuring they're always clear and supportive. If they share constructive criticism, it's with respect and care. They speak from a place of wanting the best for you, not to tear you down or make you feel small. They're here to uplift, to stand by you, and to help you grow. This is someone who wants a strong, trusting relationship built on kindness and mutual respect. They'll encourage you, but they'll also be brave enough to speak up when they think it'll help you or the relationship. This person wants you deeply, no question. They're eager to reach out, to talk to you, to offer something real. They're not only hardworking but driven, and they know the value of effort. Money doesn't just appear, and they respect that, working hard for everything they have. They don't take shortcuts or take advantage of anyone. Despite their ambition, they're also soft-hearted, kind, and caring. From the moment they first connected with your energy, they felt an instant draw to you. They sensed a unique, warm connection that felt genuine and real. It's not just attraction, they see you as, the one, their person. The Nine of Cups shows this intense, loving energy they feel whenever they think of you. They're convinced, you're the one I want. It's more than just desire, it's a connection they believe in deeply, a relationship they're ready to invest in and nurture. So, I'm just going to grab my oracle cards one second. 
There we go. We've got snake. So, we got desire, attraction, snake. Again, they have desire and attraction towards you. They want you really badly. They like your body, they like how you look. You are very attractive. You see this snake sort of engulfing this body, images, 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 you get my point. We have here as well the fact that they just really feel so, so much love towards you, so much attraction towards you, so much desire towards you, and they feel very connected towards you. And we've got here, turtle, so we've got slowness, protection, and turtle. Essentially, the main thing here is that this connection does seem to be protected. Things are moving a little bit slow, and they haven't exactly come forward and told you all of this, but there is a divine protection to this connection, from what I am seeing. They do feel very, very drawn to you and very connected to you, for sure.